क्लास फाइव साइंस टर्म वन लेसन नंबर टू एनिमल्स लिविंग एंड सर्वाइविंग लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव इन दिस लेसन यू विल लर्न अबाउट एनिमल्स विद बैकबोन एंड एनिमल्स विदाउट बैकबोन एडेप्टेशन इन एनिमल्स classification of animals according to their food habits classification of animals according to the place where they live classification of animals according to how they protect themselves endangered and extinct animals recall fill in the boxes with tick for domestic animals wrong for wild animals an elephant is a wild animal a tiger is a wild animal a cat is a domestic animal a sheep is a domestic animal a dog is a domestic animal a bear is a wild animal a pig is a domestic animal a cheetah is a wild animal introduction animals are found all over the world and can be classified into various categories according to their structure eating habits and living habits let us learn more about this classification classification of animals according to their structure some animals have backbone while some don't so they can be divided into two categories on the basis of their backbone animals which have backbone are called vertebrates vertebrates are of five types one mammals animals that feed their young ones with milk and have hair on their body are called as mammals they have four limbs and external ears their body temperature does not change any time so mammals are warm blooded some examples of mammals are dogs cats elephants and even human beings man is the only mammal without a tail fishes fishes live in water they have gills scales and fins fishes don't have lungs and use their gills for breathing they have scales on their body and don't have fur or hair they have fins for swimming they lay eggs their body temperature changes according to the temperature of their surroundings so fishes are cold blooded some examples of fishes are cod hilsa mackerel and salmon amphibians amphibians are group of animals which live both on the land and in water amphibians are born in the water when they are born they breathe with gills like a fish but when they are grown up they develop lungs and can live on the land so they have both lungs and gills for breathing they have legs for moving on land and a smooth skin they too lay eggs and are cold blooded some examples of amphibians are frogs and salamanders reptiles reptiles live on the land and on water they breathe through their lungs 
they have dry and scaly skin they have short legs and long body they lay eggs and are cold blooded some reptiles are snakes crocodiles turtles and lizards birds birds are a group of animals which have feathers and are born out of hard shelled eggs most of the birds fly with the help of wings their body is boat shaped and the bones are light and hollow some birds like ostrich do not fly as they have a heavy body and weak wings birds are warm blooded some examples of birds are crow pigeons peacocks and ostrich animals not having backbone animals which do not have a backbone are called invertebrates about 85% of all the animals in the world are invertebrates spiders insects centipedes mites ticks lobsters crab shrimp crayfish krill barnacles and scorpions are some examples of invertebrates some features of invertebrates are their body is made up of three parts head thorax and abdomen they have many joined legs or limbs a spider has eight legs while a millipede can have hundreds of legs invertebrates do not have a backbone but they have a hard skeleton outside their body this is made of a hard material called chitin which protects their body from extreme weather and attacks by other animals they can even shed their skeleton at times invertebrates are cold blooded animals some insects have wings and can fly all invertebrates lay eggs activity kids there are many strange looking fishes can you collect pictures of such fishes fishes with teeth fishes that look like a horse fishes that inflate themselves when they are in danger adaptations in animals adaptation in an organism is the change in its structure food or behavior that helps it to survive better the animals which adapt themselves can survive while the animals which can't adapt will die such animals which don't adapt are called extinct animals example dinosaurs have become extinct because they didn't adapt their environment animals adapt themselves in the following ways by changing their food habits by changing the place where they live by making changes in their body for protecting themselves activity can you find out the names of some extinct animals and birds also find out why they became extinct
what do animals do to protect themselves animals need to protect themselves from their enemies and harsh environments some examples of such adaptations in animals are given below animals like elephant and hippopotamus have thick skin and huge body to protect themselves from hot climate and enemies some animals like deer and gazelle have strong legs which help them to run fast and escape from predators some animals like chameleon zebra arctic fox polar bear grasshopper sick insect and fox can change their body color to match with their surroundings so that their predators are not able to catch them easily this is called camouflaging some animals like tiger and giant panda are in danger of extinction their number is decreasing drastically they are called endangered animals some animals like dinosaur and dodo have disappeared from the earth they are called as extinct animals activity find out the names of two endangered animals also find why they are in danger of disappearing from the earth if you like this video please share and subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon